Hi guys, Rebecca Creates here with a project share of a 3D coffee cup that I made using this die from Globeland.com. If you saw my video last week, I had an unboxing of a few die sets that they sent me free for review and I'll link the unboxing video down below as well as the link for this die set and the Globeland.com website. But um, I always get a little overwhelmed with 3D projects um, from dies, but this one was actually really easy to put together. Uh, let me show you the panel pieces. So it makes a 3D coffee cup. And so it had the panel, like the sides of it, and then the little panels that you can add as accents on the cutout pieces. So that's optional. Um, so I just started cutting like eight of these, eight sets of these. Then it has the top of the coffee cup right the lid so it has the cutout pieces and you do need to cut like two of these and then you have to cut eight of the pieces to make the lids and eight of these to make the lid um, so once I cut all the pieces out it was pretty easy to put together this set is really cute because it had extra pieces like if you wanted to do like a little Starbucks logo or something it had the little piece to cut out like where your sippy part of your lid would be or if you wanted a straw hole hole it had a smaller um, insert piece and then it had this fun piece which if you cut um, eight of them eight four of them actually you can make a coffee cup sleeve and then it had the cute little insert that said coffee so those are all the pieces let me show you how my project came out so I went with a fall themed coffee cup I think it's really cute so this is the sleeve that I cut four panels of and I did it out of glitter paper and the little piece that says coffee is there you could bling this out I thought maybe I could put some trim on the next one um, make it look really cute and then the actual coffee cup look how cute you guys it's actually like coffee cup shape, sized, like an actual maybe um, 10 ounce coffee cup. How cute is that? So my stamp didn't come out too well down there, but this is how it looks. This is the lid. You could do the lid a different way um, and make it like dimensional, but I did it this way like a real coffee cup and the lid does come off and I didn't glue these down, but basically you could fill this with some shred and maybe some goodies and send it off as friend mail and the lid i mean it all went together really well i'm kind of not so great with 3d stuff this was pretty easy to put together um i did it in like under a half hour which surprised me i picked out my papers cut eight of each piece that i needed and then just started gluing it while i was watching youtube videos so i really like it i think it's cute i think it's a fun way to send some of my like handmade resin pieces um some goodies in some happy mail um so yeah i'm really happy with it i think i will put some more of these together just to show it off the only thing i wasn't too sure of when i cut the top lid pieces these these frames came out of it and I felt like I was putting Ikea furniture together because I put it all together and I was like, wait, what's, I had just this piece. Is it supposed to go down around it or something? I don't know. Anyway. Um, yeah, so that's my project. Let me know what you guys think. And like I said, I'll have the link for this coffee cup die. This die set with all these pieces was only $5.05 on the globeland.com website. But there's also a code of Rebecca5, which will give you $5 off of a $40 order. So, I mean, for 5 bucks to get all these pieces and be able to make a 3D project, I think that was really cool and a really good deal. So their prices are pretty great on the website. Hopefully you go over and check it out. Um, yeah, so let me know what you guys think. And as always, thanks for watching, guys. Bye.